And welcome back to Flexible Games, where we are playing Planet Coaster. And many guests are thirsty. Yeah, I'm not sure why that is. I've got plenty of drink stalls located in quite a few places. But uh, they're, they're still thirsty. Part of the reason is they they run out of money and then they continue walking around the park. Uh, and there's not really much I can do about that. Uh, but... Got to find, I think that's this coaster that broke down. So let's, oh yeah, it's going to, it needs a refurbishment. So I let the game run a little bit, so build up my income a little bit more here. And uh, we're going to build another coaster, one that I recently subscribed to. And I'd like to get it going here. I'm not sure where I want to put it. We've got a couple coasters out here that are very, very popular. And uh, a few out here and only one out here. So I might end up adding it on this side just to sort of increase traffic. Plus we have a, a, a couple drink stalls here. Maybe uh, draw some more people over. I might want to put an ATM over here as well just because... In case people need some money, I want to be able to accommodate them. Oh, let's see, Planet ATM. Uh, just a generic ATM machine is fine. There we go. And now we're going to do another, another custom coaster here. Uh, I like showcasing some of these phenomenal coasters that the community is, is building. Um, the amount of time and effort that goes into these is it's just a labor of love, it looks like, because these things are absolutely fantastic. So, uh, let's see, do I wanna do it over here or over here? I think I wanna do it over here, draw some more people over on this way. Anyway, this is a compact coaster it's called Boa Constricted. Uh, pretty high excitement rating, uh, medium fear, and uh, medium low uh, nausea. But it's a compact, very twisty coaster. As you can see, it is extremely, extremely compact. Uh, that is a crazy design right there. Whoever came up with this design my hat's off because that is a wicked looking coaster and it's so it's so small that I might be able to well that's already extremely dense in there I mean I could put it right in here I could put it right in here and add another coaster to that that area but again, I wanted to draw some more people over this way. So, beautiful, beautiful work on this coaster. So we're gonna sink it down into the ground so it's not floating above the ground. I wonder if I could put it all the way down. Nope, has to be up a little bit right there. Okay, so how do I want to place this? Is there a better place to put this? I could put it right at the beginning of the entrance, and that might go some, do something for us. I really need to get rid of this train. Uh, not very many people are running on it, and it is really costing me a lot of money because I don't charge a whole lot for it. Okay, so if we're going to put this over here, I want to I want a queue. So how about right in here? Beautiful. Uh place entrance. I'm assuming he wants me to place it there. And there. So let's uh, place a path, first of all. Uh, four meters is fine. Uh, I want to snap. Uh, why, 
aren't you wanting to snap right? Okay, whatever. Okay, connect entrance to path. I want to go up this way. I want to get a little bit of that scenery in there. And let's see, where can we come out? Give myself a little space for scenery in here. Give a little bit more scenery action. And that is a little tight. Let's move that in right there. And I can't really click on this one for some reason. I don't know why I can't click on that, but we won't worry about it right now. Uh, I want to... What's the cost of this? $20? That's a little, that's a little high. Um, let's try... Let's try 8 to begin. And then lower it over time. So we got... Pretty good stuff here. Maintenance. Uh, we're going to do a test. We're going to have to do a test first. I won't ride this one because I have a feeling it would make everybody sick who watches the video. So uh, I'm just going to. Lots of bends and twists and turns and. Fantastic design. Look at that. A roller coaster that fits into this tiny, tiny space. That's pretty darn good. People are shuffled right and left and... Looks like these are like accelerators. These in here. I don't even know what kind of coaster this is. This is crazy. It's a pretty long ride considering too. That is intense. I don't even know I don't even know which one is in the in the front. Oh, it looks like this one coming down. It'll go around and stop at the station. Brilliant. So let's uh, open her up. And what's the prestige on this? 1019. That's pretty good. So let's look at scenery. Let's look at blueprinted scenery here. Pirate skirmish. Got a lot of pirate themed stuff in here. Uh, so we're going to sink that down just a little bit. And. Wow. There's a lot of stuff in here. Okay, let's see. I don't have any sci-fi stuff in the in the game yet. Redcoat skirmish. Okay. I'm going to put this on this side. And then I'm going to have to rotate these to match up. That guy is fine. This guy I want to move. Rotate him just a little more. And then, of course, I got to get all of these so they're Are those guys shooting in the general direction? Sort of. I'm not too picky about it. The ride scenery is pretty good. 
And we want to name this Boa Constricted. Okay, $8 a pop. We're doing pretty good. Um, let's look at, uh, let's see. Finances are doing okay. I have a couple months. There are a few months that uh, I drop a little bit. Um, part of the reason we're dropping is a lot of these rides are not full. A lot of these simple rides are not at all full because their reputation goes down. Uh, and that's a setting that we could actually override and make it a little bit more simplistic uh, and a little bit more profitable. But I want to keep it like like it is for now. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna mess with it. Make it easier on me. I just want I want my guests to be happy. That is that is the basics of it. See, this thing is losing money. Uh, finances. Look at that. Fifteen grand. This thing has lost me now. Uh, so I think I think we're just gonna close it. Because you look at the maintenance. It's Wear and tear is pretty low. We're just gonna close it down and replace it with something else. Uh, I don't wanna. I don't wanna deal with that much loss of money. Uh, these are also probably starting to lose money. Yeah, this one's losing money. This one's lost. This one's lost a ton of money. This. This ride here which is unfortunate but if I got rid of it I would have this whole space open for another ride so might want to think about that bump and derby is broken down crest refurbishment so we need to add this ride to the work roster on this side in order for that to so this is east wing i believe if i look at it from this direction no it's west this is the west wing so you can see the rides here we're going to add this ride this ride and this one's already highlighted everything in there is good i do believe this one is selected it's kind of hard to tell though if it's selected or not we'll, we'll claim that it is so we're going to save that and go over here and create a couple places for people to sit down and take a load off because they might need to rest after that crazy crazy ride uh, we're going to do all let's grab some bins case they have any trash any any janitors that are on that are uh, selected on here here's one here you automatically you know will walk back through here now that we added this to the ride to the work roster I mean lots and lots of people coming in here we've got an ATM here sort of hoping people Grab money from it. Oh yeah, this will be able to process a lot of people as well. All right, have you been refurbished? You've been refurbished. So you're good there. Interesting. Just kind of hanging out in the air.
That is a cool ride. I can't... I couldn't imagine riding something like that in real life. Boy, that would be... That would be intense. That would be really intense. All right, let's take a look at staff here. Uh, my mechanics, my workloads are all low on my mechanics, uh, and that is fine for now. Um, as I add rides to each one of these, you know, we have entrance, east, south, and west. As I add rides to these, these workloads will go up because they'll have more to, more to inspect, more to fix. And it looks like we have some high workload here, so let's let's up his. And then we've got one here. Really, who is this? She is serving fries. Workload is high. She is already an expert. Um, how is the shop doing profit profit wise? The shop is actually pulling in quite a bit of money, but uh, I don't yet want to increase your salary because look at the look at the running costs um, compared to the profit. We're only you know two hundred fifty dollars a profit a month, and if I upped her salary from training her, that would uh, kind of negate any profit that we would get from that. That specific spot. I'm not really wanting to do that. So the next ride I would like to build this genie ride. See if we can fit it right in here. We could right in here. Okay, and now let's set up the entrance over here. This is kind of a tricky one here. I'm going to put the exit on this side. And we're going to path this together. Like so. And then the... This, I'm going to have to... Come around... Like so. Create kind of meandering path. Connect it up. Bring a few people up in here, and we have drinks up here. So you should be able to set this up. Okay, the sequence. Standard spin, stall, spin, end. Stall, spin, long, drifting spin. I'm going to take one of those off. Finance is fine. Maintenance is fine. And we have to test it. So let's test her out. And let's see, scenery wise, we got lots of scenery around here. What's the scenery rating on this? Oh, 100%, look at that. All the scenery that we have in this area is benefiting this ride as well, which is nice. This ride is doing pretty good. Look at that queue. Beautiful sight. And where is my janitor for the for this wing here? He he has a garbage over here that he needs to empty. A few garbages actually, now that I look at it. Uh what wing is this? This would kind of be the north wing, unless I named it wrong. But 
This is still going. Are we are we close to getting done here? There we go. Well, that was a long duration on that. Well, I'm glad I took that other one off. 100 seconds. Let's open her up. Pretty low prestige, which is fine. Uh, how are the prestiges on these? These are still strong. Really strong. Good, good to go. A little lower on that one. How about the Inferno? Oh yeah, the Inferno is rocking. Although the queue seems to be emptying. Slowly. We're going to need to pull some more people over here. Hopefully we'll get some more money here. Because we got a few more coasters to, to implement. I've got this one here called Adrenaline. And it's really expensive. 51000 to build this thing. Versus the thirteen to build this one. So that is going to be a little while before I'm able to afford that. Although some of these other ones I might be able to get away with building them uh, in the meantime. Like this 17 or this 16,000. Those two uh, would, also, would also work. I'll be able to build them a little sooner. Just to draw more people over here. Maybe maybe they'll see the queue as as, as good and... Hit it up. So in this one, yeah, we have zero people wanting to run to this one. It's kind of a little cove back here. So not sure, not sure if that's going to be a successful or not. No idea. But that will have to do it for this episode. And I thank you for watching, and I will see you next time.